Hey guys, I'm gonna be showing you on an iPhone how to set up particular clips in the app Clamor for your podcast to use for promotion. Uh, just little tidbits if you're not sure, Clamor is, if you've never heard of it, you basically share small audio clips up to 24 seconds, share those on social media, uh, they autoplay, people can listen and just hear short little clips and it kind of just gains interest for your show. Um, and that way people, if they like what they hear, they can click on it, listen to the full episode and that drives them to your podcast or to your website or whatever you pick. So, uh, two things you want to have ready to go before you get started, before you open clamor, you need to make sure that whatever podcast episode you want to take a clip from that you have that in your podcast app and that it's downloaded and that it is, uh, is ready to go. The other thing is that you'll need the the full mp3 download link of your podcast episode so for example on libsyn once you publish your show you'll get an mp3 link for the download you will need that on hand i know it's sometimes difficult to log into libsyn on your phone and be able to like view and copy that so if, just have that pasted somewhere ready to roll before you open this so first things first we'll just open clamor here now, depending on how long your shows are, you might want to listen to the episode itself and then make note of a few different times where you want to pull clips from. Um, it's a little difficult to listen through the entire thing on Clamor. So what I usually do is just listen on iTunes. I'll take a screenshot whenever I hear something or I'll write down the time whenever I hear something that I want to use. And then once I have them all written down, I'll go ahead and pull all those quotes. So here we are on the Clamor, uh, the main screen. Click the menu on the left hand side and go to create. When you get to this screen, uh, it looks like I had something already pulled up. Let's reset so you can see. Uh, at the bottom, you want to pick where you're going to grab your audio from. You can go from SoundCloud if your podcast is hosted on SoundCloud. I just recommend podcasts. Uh, and then we'll do Rogue Squadron, our show, and then our newest episode, Captain America. So it starts to generate the waveform depending on how long it is. It might it might take a bit. Um, so I'm just going to arbitrarily pick a time. So let's say uh, I want to go to two minutes. So you just grab the waveform in the center and you can scroll kind of slowly. Or you can grab the slider on the bottom and scroll much faster. So, well, here, I'll just, I, I landed at 40. Let's just pick there. So we'll play this. And okay, and it just crashed. So we'll hit play. Uh, unfortunately, you won't be able to hear that at the moment, but you can see the slider up top is moving. Um, this will be able to tell you, because you might not want the full 24 second clip, you might want to make it a little shorter than that. So this will be able to tell you where you want to start and stop. Once you've listened and you kind of pinpoint where you want it to go, grab the blue slider on the right hand side and you can trim the clip like this. So let's say I just want it to be about 12 seconds long. And once you have it set, you want to go hit next, go to the next stop. Now it automatically is going to make a post title here up top with whatever the title of the podcast episode is. Uh, this is what goes on Clamor and you can change the title to whatever you want. Here in the bottom is a full description. And again, it will just pull the show notes from the, and the title from the, uh, from the podcast, however it is listed in the RSS. You can change that to whatever you want. And then you can also share on, have it set to share on Twitter. Post to Twitter and then you can put your own tweet message there. And same thing with Facebook. Post to Facebook and you can change that to whatever you need to. And before, the last thing before you post it is click the RSS uh, icon and this is where you're going to link it back to your actual podcast episode and this is the most convenient part because what happens is when people listen to this clip say it's right in the middle of the podcast if they like it they click on it it will take them to the actual podcast episode in itunes right where that left off 
so people can pick up right from where that clip was pulled and just keep listening to the episode. So it's really convenient. So we'll do uh, MP3. And you do want to take note of where the clip left off. So let's say for this one, it was 4055 is where the clip ended. So I hit the RSS button, choose MP3. On the right-hand side, start at 40 minutes and 55 seconds. Done. And then you have to get the URL. So again, you want to have that um, the MP3 link from Libsyn ready to go. I'm going to open Google Drive where I have it listed out and just copy and paste. And this is just if you have if you aren't doing something like this already, it's a good idea to just have all your episodes listed out with the link, easy access, so you can grab it and share it whenever you need to without having to go into Libsyn. Uh, so this is episode sixty nine. Got the title, and here's the link. Copy, and go back to Clamor, paste, boom. And it will start right at that time. And now that's all you need to do. Hit save. And post. Beautiful. Uh, so you won't be able to hear this, unfortunately, right now because of how I have my mic set up. But this is the newest clip I just posted. Kept it here. So we'll play that. And the hear more button. Uh, you can see that. It has the RSS feed. It says how long the full episode is. If I click that. It goes straight to, I'm still in the Clamor app, but I am actually pulling from the podcast feed. So this counts as a play, which is very convenient, especially if you're tracking, you know, downloads and listens of your show. And then you can also put all of your, uh, I mean, you can put a link to the full episode in here on iTunes. You can put a link to your website, whatever you want to do. And then you can share further from there. And what I'd recommend after this point is um, just like you have the links and the descriptions saved in a document for all your episodes. I would do the same thing for these clamor uh, clips. You know, you can share, copy the link to it and that way it'll be a uh, very easy access for you to go through and share it when you're done. So that is it. I hope this uh, makes sense and I hope this is beneficial for you guys that are looking to get some extra exposure to your shows.